interested. Hey everyone, if you'd like to try out Filmora and start creating amazing videos, check the link in my description. That's where you can download Filmora directly. Don't miss it. I wish I could give you up, but you're my new favorite drug. Enter into my blood, run with my toxic love. Look how you make me happy. Welcome. Begin by dragging a background color onto the timeline and stretch it to your preferred length. Next, return to the media section, add a picture on top, and extend it to about 10 seconds as demonstrated. Next, click the crop icon at the top, set the aspect ratio to 16:9, and select pan and zoom. Adjust the frame as desired, then use the swap icon to switch the start and end positions and click apply. Now click and go up to add a keyframe for transform, scale it down to zero and set the X position to minus 439.86. So the animation starts from the left side. Then move the playhead to the one second mark. Next, go up to add a keyframe to transform, increase the scale to 50 and set the X position to minus 1103.67. So it animates slightly onto the screen. Then move the playhead to the three second mark. Now go up to add a transform keyframe and move the playhead to the four second mark. Add another transform keyframe, then increase the scale to 65 and reset the X position to zero so the image is centered. Next, move the playhead to the six second mark and add a transform keyframe. Then move it to seven seconds, add another transform keyframe, scale the image down to 55, and set the X position to 110367 as shown. Move the playhead to the nine second mark and add a transform keyframe. Then move it to the end, add another transform keyframe, scale the image down to zero, and set the X position to 1439.86. Finally, preview the animation as shown. Using the third keyframe as a guide, hold and press the Alt key and drag the picture upward to create a duplicate. Repeat this process using that third keyframe as a guide to make as many duplicates as you like as shown above. Scroll down, then go to Media and drag in additional pictures, holding Alt to replace the ones on the timeline until the final image is replaced as shown. After that, move the playhead to the end and shorten the background color clip so its length matches the top layer's duration, then preview. Select all the clips, right-click, and choose Create Compound Clip. Then, on the left panel, right-click and delete any empty tracks as shown. Next, move the playhead to the four-second mark where the first picture is centered, then split and delete that first segment. Drag the remaining clip back, move the playhead to the 22-second mark where the last picture is centered, split again, delete the last segment, and preview the result. Go up to Effects and search for Color Slice. Drag it onto the timeline and stretch it to match the full duration. Click the effect and lower its opacity to 70. Then return to Effects, search for Colorful Lighting. Scroll to Colorful Lighting Flares Overlay 08, drag it above the clip, extend it to match the duration, and reduce its opacity to 10 as shown. Go back to Effects and search for Instant Memory. Scroll down, drag Instant Memory's frame 3 onto the timeline, reduce it to 2 seconds. 
Then right-click and choose Create Compound Clip as shown. Select the clip, then go up to reduce the scale to 80 so it fits neatly in the center of the picture as shown. Go to Transitions and add a Dissolve Transition to the compound clip. Select the transition and set its duration to 5 frames. Then add another Dissolve Transition at the end. Click the first Start Transition and choose Apply to All, so both Start and End Transitions share the same 5-frame duration as shown. Right-click the Frame Compound Clip and select Copy. Move the playhead to the 3-second mark where the picture is centered, select the track, and paste. Repeat by moving the playhead to 6 seconds, paste again, then to 9 seconds and 12 seconds, continuing at 2-second intervals to paste the frame compound clip as, as shown. For the last compound clip, I reduced it to match the underlying duration and delete the end transition. Then I previewed it. I wrapped up with thanks for your amazing support. The template link and the Filmora download link are provided in the description. Have a beautiful day. Toxic